I am back again with another vlog and I'm just getting a couple of drinks because I'm gonna get one hot one cold to take up to me to the office and then I thought we'd catch up on kind of what I've been up to and um, what I'm about to do today for working from home and building my businesses so give me a minute let me just get ready and get my drinks upstairs and then I'll chat to you then so you are precariously balanced on one two three four things so uh, yeah please be careful <laughs> basically just wanted to to catch up with you with kind of what I'm doing behind the scenes of working on my business. I used to do quite like quite a few vlogs, not a lot because I'm not the best at it. But um, I thought, you know what? Like, why not let's amp up the vlogs a little bit so you can really see what it's like behind the scenes with me building my business and um, basically like what I'm doing. I, if you don't know, what I build digital product businesses. I teach you guys how to do that as well on my other videos on my YouTube channel. So today is a little bit of an interesting one. I have quite a few people to reply to. I'm actually going to be doing an interview soon, hopefully. I don't know if she's even watching this now. Um, but with somebody who basically took my art printables and Etsy course and went on to do amazing things inside of their business with the help from that course. And I asked basically if I could chat to her. Um, and I've never really done that before. So it's very real what you guys see um, in terms of when you watch my vlogs and my videos about building a business. But that is you know, something I'm quite excited about. And also inside my membership group as well. I'm doing tons of stuff in there today. I'm not ready. Um, so there's a lot to do, but I haven't even written my to-do list because I was spending the morning washing my hair, getting stuff sorted out, and I ordered something online that I'm going to show you guys and talk to you guys about in a minute because it is something that I've always wanted for my kind of work from home life, for my home office, and um, for keeping me organized. But it was very expensive and um, it was something that I basically discovered a long time ago when I was shopping in Harrods and then I just saw it and I thought at the time like no I, I can't justify getting that and I've just watched so many videos of it ever since and so I went and bought it so I'm going to kind of let you know what that is a little bit later on in the video. So anyway let's basically stop chatting and let's get on with the actual day in fact what i'm gonna do give me a second i'm actually gonna take some of these things from over here so that we can sit you down on my desk and you can actually work through some things with me that i am doing in my office today Okay, so it turns out I'm going to end up using my phone to record this video today because, um, again, my Canon G7X is just playing up. I just can't seem to get the lighting right and all of those wonderful things. So instead, we are doing it on my phone. Back into my office today, I've got a lot of things that I want to get done. One of the things I might as well just kind of like come out and say, basically the thing that I had all I've ordered is something that is going to hopefully play a massive part in my day to day routine with building my businesses, with working from home. And that is because I've ordered the Louis Vuitton um, agenda in the medium size, I think it is. And basically it is something that I've been thinking about getting for absolutely ages, um, but I finally kind of made the decision to get it today. And I think it's gonna be coming next week, but I'll show you guys in a little bit which one I've decided to get and why I decided to get it. But if you have been watching any of my YouTube videos, if you watched my previous vlogs that I did in the past, sorry there's so much stuff here, um, like my previous vlogs that I did in the past, you will know that I am someone who is a stickler for planning and organisation and every single day I use a planner, I use a to-do list, it is my thing, it is what's helped me build my businesses, I, I honestly credit it to being the thing that has helped me go from obviously having a normal 9 to 5 job to being able to work from home. So right now I use the uh, full focus planner, which basically is, I'm not going to change this at all. This is an absolutely amazing, phenomenal planner that I use. It's, it's, I think it's just because it works in a way that really works for me. So basically inside of the planner and because it's on my phone, this is going to be back to front, but it, you can still make out what it is. So every day you have a page, well, you have two pages of like a full cover. 
and on one side you have where you write down your to-do list you can write down things that you're doing throughout the day in terms of time wise there they also have this thing which is really amazing and it's called your daily big three which is like once you've written your to-do list you just what i use it for is just to highlight which of the tasks that i have today is going to be are going to be the three most important ones to work on you can use it in a different way where you basically have like you pick at the beginning of the week what your big three is and then you just keep working on it throughout the week but that's kind of like how i like to use this planner at the moment and then on the other side you have a notes page which is so brilliant and i use it every single day so just a little one, one there is every day there and i use it basically to write down notes so for example if i don't get something done on the day before i will you know turn over the page and add it into that one this planner has been so so amazing to the point that i think i have four of these now that i have used and um, you get them they i think they're every quarter that you they, they last for every quarter if you know what i mean so they're absolutely wonderful but what i wanted to do is get an additional planner because this is very to-do list style so one that i can actually write down times dates things that I want to be doing, things that are a little bit outside of business, but they're going to take up time for me working on my business, if that makes sense, and um, to go with this and complement this. So I will show you guys which one I got a little bit later on, but now let's actually go on with some work. I'm figuring out all of the different lighting areas and everything inside of my office, so please forgive me if my first couple of vlogs back again are not the best in kind of quality and visuals. Um, I'm just trying to get it right while also kind of what something I really want to do inside of my vlogs is I want to be just really open and transparent about building digital product businesses about working from home making income from home my everyday lifestyle of doing it so you know this is something I do inside of my Evenos office membership I create like Sunday reviews where I talk to my members exactly what I've been up to each week we build my business to keep them motivated I do Monday motivation videos where I talk all about building their businesses and, and you know different things and hurdles we go through but what i really want on my youtube channel with my vlogs and with my sit down videos and also obviously inside of my products like my courses and my membership site is i want a, a space where you can come and feel like we're talking to your best friend about building a business and all of the worries that you potentially hit as well as all the good things that you experience and I want, you know, a really kind of happy environment where effectively I call like my Evenos office members, for example, co-workers, where we all just kind of, you know, we go through the reality of building a business. So I feel like so many people start building online businesses and they'll grab a course or they'll start learning from somebody where the, the advice is, you know, it's helpful because it will give you, okay, this is the next step and that's the next step. But inevitably, you hit mental hurdles along that way. You know, you start your business and suddenly you get frustrated because it's just not building the way that they told you it was going to build. And actually, instead of just giving up and throwing everything away, you just needed some mental support to get you past that hurdle to actually start seeing the amazing rewards of building your business. So that was just for me to say that I wanted to start doing some of these vlogs and the quality is not always going to be the best. And um, just because I want to, you know, show you the reality of what it's like building a business, creating content and creating digital products and all that stuff. So with that in mind, let's dive into um, a little bit about what I'm going to do today. And I will show you some stuff all about it, as well as show you the Louis Vuitton um, agenda that I bought. So let's talk about what I'm going to do today. So my first thing first, I'm going to use my planner. This is my most important thing. It's again, the full focus planner. And what I basically do is sit down. It just has like a day of the week. It doesn't have an exact date. So for example, today, by the time when I'm, this is going out, probably a different day, but today is Friday. So with that, I just sit down. I've got tons. You could probably see this here. So, so many things inside of that. You'll probably see the lipstick stain on my cup as well. Um, but basically, I just use pens and I love to use... Um, they're called highlighters because I just have to list things off, like tick them off once I've done them. And basically, I'm just going to sit down and go through everything that I need to do. I have completed effectively my morning routine, which I really, I always write that down, like every single day. 
I write down in my planner that I do my morning routine that usually consists of going for a walk or doing some sort of exercise before starting the day, getting myself ready for the day, things like that. The next thing I need to do is check my orders for my um, Etsy shop. My Etsy shop has been doing really well with orders lately, which is really, really great. But I would have to then remember to keep on top of that because some of the things that I have are obviously digital products, but I do also have a couple of dropship products in there as well. And um, so I always want to just make sure and check that all of that is done. I want to make sure that I have lunch as well because I sometimes get so excited what I'm doing I forget to eat. Um, if you guys experience that, let me know. Sometimes you just get so absorbed in something that you don't even realise that you haven't eaten that day. That tends to be me sometimes. Um, and then another thing that I really need to do is I need to reply to um, the person who I said that I want to have a conversation with about the success of their Etsy shop and their Etsy business um, and just really, as well as, um, you know, interview them, I really want to learn from them. I want to, you know, that's part of my experience with building my businesses and helping others is a great thing about it is that they can help me too. So that would be amazing. And in, if she's comfortable with it, I'm going to hopefully share that um, video inside of some of my projects and also potentially on my YouTube channel. So that is something um, I'm going to look at. So I need to reply to their email because I need to get that sorted and set up. I need to add vi videos into my art principles on Etsy course because I'm doing some updated videos in there. Um, and I'm also doing, like I did a couple of shop audits for different people. I went through, talk through their shop with them. So I want to upload those into um, my online course. And then also, I have a live event that I'm just reading that to make sure I have a live event coming up inside of the Evenos office and membership. So I basically want to prep for that, make sure I'm all ready for that. It's a big goals live event that I'm going to be doing. So I'm really helping people set their goals about building their digital product businesses this, this coming year in 2023. So I need to do a little bit of prep for that. So I'm going to go ahead and fill this out and then I'm going to start getting to work and just working through it really. trying to get a few things done on my to-do list. I'm going to stop and have some lunch in a minute because I always forget when I'm like enthusiastic about something to stop and have some lunch. So that's what I'm going to do. I'll be replying to a couple of people inside of my membership site. I'm also, like inside of my membership site, I do a podcast where I basically every month talk about something that I did inside my business and how you could do the same thing. This one I really enjoyed because it was about me putting myself on social media, how I got started as a very, very small um, online creator, um, and also how I still that still enables me to drive in traffic, make sales, and that you don't have to have a massive following um, in order to basically you know, have success on social media. And one of the great things about that is then you can continue to grow and continue to see success. But it's kind of really interesting because um, basically I had a conversation with somebody and they really, really opened my eyes to so many more things that I could do and so many amazing things that I could expand into with my business. And it's really like lit a fire in me to, to really start doing that. But it's so interesting because this is something that I really hit a lot inside of my own business. Like, as I always say, I'm just one very, very small online creator, online seller, digital product creator. And so, and I'm learning all this as I go along and I love sharing this with you guys um, because I feel like you guys can benefit from things that I learn as well as I can benefit from what you guys learn. But one thing I realized I used to always fall into the trap of when I was starting and building my business is I used to start something and then someone would come along or I'd watch a YouTube channel or video about it or I'd see it on a blog and tell me that there was another way to do something and I'd get even better results and I'd have even more success if I did that. And then I would like run off, throw everything that I was working on, run off to go chase that and see if I could have that success. And then I'd come back again later on after, after inevitably realizing like, oh, that's no, that's working out no better than what I'm doing now. I'd then end up coming back and working back on the thing that I originally did. And I kind of call it like, 
the octopus on roller skates is the way I kind of like think about it when you're trying to build a business, that approach of building a business. And it's really this thing of like, you decide you want to create a business and then you start working on it and you have a clear plan of what you want to do. But then something happens over here that tells you, oh, you need to be doing that. So you run over and you start trying to do that whilst perhaps even trying to do this bit. And then you, there's someone else tells you there's something else over there that you could do better. So you run over there working on that and you start just you know, trying to do a million different things, hoping that by spreading yourself super, super thin with those things that you're going to get some success somewhere and something's going to hit really big. And in the end, you just end up tiring yourself out. And I did that for quite a while and it's only recently. And honestly, thanks massively to my membership site and to, you know, talking to, actually getting to talk to you guys inside of there and, and see and learn and progress with your businesses, they really started to realize that's just not a good approach. And it was actually slowing my business down from the success that I really wanted it to have and I wanted to continue to have even more of. I really started to look at just honing down and focusing in on things that actually have a benefit and impact in my business. And for me, one of those things is YouTube. Um, but also there are other elements inside of my business as well that have like a really massive benefit. And what I've decided now is to focus on just amplifying that and focus on growing that and building that rather than doing that crazy running around. So I thought I'd just kind of mention that really because I know that a lot of you guys who watch my channel are people who are working on your own businesses or you're kind of starting to work on your own business or thinking about it. Um, and these lessons I think can be really, really valuable because it took me a long time to figure that out and in reality, a lot of wasted money as well. I have a couple more people that I have to reply back to and what I'm gonna do as well is show you guys the um, actual agenda I decided to pick up and explain to you why I decided to get this one. So this is the agenda that I decided to purchase. It's the medium ring agenda um, and basically it's in the monogram canvas. And this is honestly, I I know it might not be to some people, but it is to me. It's a really big deal of um, a product to purchase. But I've been working on my businesses for a few years now and I remember seeing this inside of Harrods and I remember, you know, I'm not always massively impressed with designer items, but this just really did stand out to me. And and I ended up watching a ton of reviews on it and I really just thought, do you know what? It's something that I've worked hard inside of my business and I would like to have as something that I see every day when I'm working on my business. So I'm going to try it. I'm going to, I've ordered it and hopefully it'll be delivered soon. And then I am going to try it, see what I think. I'll definitely let you guys know what I think um, and get excited about it. If any of you guys know any um, like filler pages that you recommend for this, I would love to know because I'm not really sure. It's the medium one. So if any of you guys use it or if you know someone who uses it, if there's any kind of place that I could go to get really nice filler pages. I looked at Louis Vuitton's ones, but I just... I thought actually I want a little bit more customization and options than that. So I would love um, if anyone could tell me any good places I can go to get some. I am definitely going to um, basically, you know, get on with work for the rest of the day now. So I just wanted to basically kind of give you a little bit of a behind the scenes of what I've been up to, you know, about something fun that I've picked up. I will of course do hopefully another vlog when I get it so you guys can see what it's like, how useful it is inside of my business, how much I enjoy Enjoy having it inside of my business and inside of my home office. So obviously on my channel, I'm still gonna continue always to talk about any planner that works for me, but I thought I just wanted to, to give it a go and hopefully I will really enjoy it. I've heard some really lovely reviews about it. I just think it looks absolutely beautiful in a home office and in an office space and a work environment too. And we will see how I get on. But now I'm going to get back to reality and continue working. And I will see you in the next vlog, guys. And I will catch you up. Let me know if there's anything that you guys want to know that I get up to inside of my business. I'm happy to, you know, share whatever it is that you guys are interested in. I'm try. I always try and be very real inside of my Even Those Office YouTube channel because I know how important it is to actually see behind the scenes of what it's like. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you want to watch more vlogs. I'm going to have so many more work from home vlogs coming soon. Definitely subscribe if you do want to continue watching these. And also, I always leave links to everything, including my courses and any resources to help you build in your own online business and working from home and all of those wonderful things. I always leave those in the description box below so you always have access to them. But I will see you in the next video, guys. Bye.